This morning, outside the window, we could hear a robin singing for about a half hour. Now we're outside again, hoping to get a, a, a sound of the song sparrow. Sounds of spring are coming. The birds are prophesying warmer weather as we approach towards springtime. Psalm 16 is also a prophecy, a prophecy about the coming of Jesus Christ and his resurrection. When we look into Psalm 16, we can hear the sounds of something sweet to come, the resurrection of believers, the resurrection of Jesus Christ. Psalm 16 tells us, uh, even as we listen for that song sparrow, keep me safe, O God, for in you I take refuge. I said to the Lord, you are my Lord. Apart from you, I have no good thing. As for the saints who are in the land, they are the glorious ones in whom is all my delight. The sorrows of those will increase who run after other gods. I will not pour out their libations of blood or take up their names on my lips. Lord, you have assigned my portion and my cup. You have made my lot secure. The boundary lines have fallen for me in pleasant places. Surely I have a delightful inheritance. I will praise the Lord who counsels me. Even at night, my heart instructs me. I have set the Lord always before me. Because he is at my right hand, I will not be shaken. And this is the part that's uh, carried over into the New Testament by Peter and by Paul as they speak and as they write, verse 9 uh, through the end. And there's the song sparrow again. Therefore my heart is glad and my tongue rejoices. My body also will rest secure because you will not abandon me to the grave, nor will you let your Holy One see decay. You have made known to me the path of life. You will fill me with joy in your presence, with eternal pleasures at your right hand. Ah, oh, the New Testament writers refer back to this as a prophecy about Jesus Christ and his resurrection, and uh, the victory over the sleep of death, the victory of forgiveness for our sins in Jesus Christ. And it directs our attention to Jesus Christ again and again, even as the birds call out. And Jesus said, look at the birds. Let them be your teachers. And they prophesy about more than the coming of spring. They prophesy about God's goodness to his people. And uh, carrying out his promised word. We're just delighting in this, these birds out here uh, and the song sparrow today. Thanks for sharing this moment with me. 